Hello, I'm Brian Scott-Smith for World Risk and Insurance News, and this is our Week in Review. Last week on RIN TV. Monday morning headlines from SNL featured flooding in western states after Hurricane Odile made landfall. This just as the White House agreed to financial assistance for Hawaii after Tropical Storm Izell. Fitch reports says low investment returns and the search for yield pose long-term risks to reinsurers. A KPMG survey of insurance executives revealed how ill-prepared the industry is for self-driving cars. And life insurers invested heavily in the sports network with TV rights to Los Angeles Dodgers baseball games. We continued our coverage of the Monte Carlo Rendezvous with our interviews with CoreLogic Equicat President Paul Little, Brad Adderley, a partner at Appleby and member of ILS Bermuda, and Andrea Best, head of the London office of the law firm of Drinker, Biddle and Reith. And we closed out our coverage of the recent NAPSO convention, including discussions with NAPCO CEO David Pagumian, AAMGA Executive Director Bernie Hines, Brenda Ballard Austinfeld, the president of RT Specialties Kansas City, Bill Wilkinson, the national casualty president at Risk Placement Services, Yana Stavrakis, VP of Client Relations at AM Wins, Kurt Kohorst, head of Productivity Solutions Group at Resource Pro. National Risk Retention Association Chairman Sandy Elsass explained the evolution of RRGs and his positive outlook for the future. And our Cyber Risk series picked up with host Citadel Information Group President Stan Stahl discussing the management of major losses after a cyber breach with Serene Davis, an underwriter at Beasley. If you missed these or any of our previous programs, watch them now on our on-demand library and make sure to join us next time for more world risk and insurance news right here on RIN TV.